Today we're showing you how to change the DI resin in your pure water system. If your TDS meter reads 10 ppm or higher, it's time for a replacement. Let's begin. First, use a large filter wrench to loosen the housing from your pure water system. Carefully unscrew the housing. Next, remove the cap of the cartridge by twisting it off. Take out the white filter inside and set it aside. Once the cartridge is open, dump the used resin into the trash. Now, start filling the DI cartridge with new resin. Make sure to pack the resin in as much as you can, while leaving enough space at the top for the white donut-shaped filter to fit snugly. After the cartridge is filled, twist the cap back on securely. To maintain the longevity of your O-rings, be sure to apply a small amount of lube to the black O-ring. This helps to prevent cracking over time. Also, apply lube to the thin O-ring that sits inside the DI housing. Place the cartridge back into the housing. Make sure the O-ring on the cartridge is facing upwards. Screw the housing back onto the system by hand. It's important to only hand tighten to make sure you don't damage the threads. That's it. Your system is now good to go with fresh DI resin. Remember, regular maintenance is key to the efficiency of your pure water system. If you have any questions or wish to talk to a pure water expert, head over to windowcleaner.com.